guys, it is Monday. This is Susan again on uh, a beautiful, beautiful morning. I'm in the truck today. The truck. Yes, I'm in a truck. Um, this morning, I just want to share with you, I've had some huge revelations of, of life and how the mind really works. Um, I'm... Just to let you know, we have our grandma who lives with us. She's 93 years old, and she's been, she's had Alzheimer for quite, not quite a long time. And um, I really see what, how our mind works and how it functions just watching her. Because right now we've been giving her, um, you know, coconut oil to to really help her, um, and it was helping a lot. It was. However, some uh, in the last few weeks, it's it's been it's she's been deteriorating, and um, I don't know what it is. I can't pinpoint it, but I can see whatever she in her world, whatever she chooses to focus on, it is that's her world. So lately, she if she focuses on I have no money, I don't know how I'm gonna pay you guys. Uh, uh, someone is gonna hurt me. Someone's gonna kill me in the middle of the night. Like, her fears are so evident. It's because she's so focused on that. And it's so... And her world is just... It's just... It's scary. It's so scary. But that's the world she lives in. Whereas, in our minds, she's completely safe. She's with us. We are feeding her everything. We're taking care of her. She's in a nice home. She's with people she loves. And... But in her mind... It's alien to her. It's like, I don't know these, I don't want to stay here. I don't want to, I feel, I feel like I have no money. I can't pay these people. Why are they being so nice to me? It's like, I, I got to leave. She, we almost lost her too. She was, just went off and wandered off on her own without telling anybody. And it's like, oh my gosh, it's like we have to have, there's this mindset of hers that's, that feels, she's not, it's like, all of a sudden, she's focused on what she doesn't have. And the more she focuses on that, the more upset she gets. And it's so wild because it's the complete opposite. She should be so grateful that she's not in a nursing home. She should be grateful that she has help. She is so grateful that she has food to eat. She has nice homes. She has people who love her. And it's such night and day. It's night and day. And I, I watch how our minds work. It's so evident. The more, and you know, all the lives that we, you know, every experience we have, all our memories, they shape and they mold us in who we are. And it just, it hit me last night because she was just crying last night. Just crying because she was so afraid to be alone. And she couldn't, she couldn't take, she couldn't receive our love. She couldn't receive how we want to take care of her. She couldn't receive it. And then the next morning, she forgot everything. She forgot everything. I prayed on her. I prayed that God would comfort her. She would forget all that pain. God. You know, it's amazing how our feelings can to put our world into something different. It's, it's amazing what you believe in. And it really affected me last night because I just sat there going, I can't imagine what she's going through. Thank goodness she forgot everything this morning. Now she's fine. No pain. No sorrow. No depression. I'm sure it will come back. But imagine your mind and what we look into. I, I, I feel like, I don't know. I just feel like, whoa, I don't want to be dragged into that world. I want to be a powerful, powerful person. I want to be able to overcome any obstacle. I want to focus on what I'm good at. I want to focus on what I know. So this, this video is just something that's coming straight from my heart of how the mind works. And I just choose. I choose not to be a victim. I choose to be a victor. And no matter what's coming at us, no matter what's coming through, I, I let it go. I know. I just think, you know what? It's going to pass. She's going she's gonna to be all right. She's going to be okay. I'm not going to get dragged into that world. So I, it's just something to share. So I don't know if you're going through the same thing. I don't know if you are. If you are, I pray right now that God comforts you and your family that surrounds you with angels, gives you supernatural wisdom to be an overcomer. 
to be strong, to rise up, to have courage. I, I pray for that on you right now in Jesus' name. Just want to give that to you. I know this is a different video today. I just had just it's just me today. That's all that's coming out. Love you. Bye. Talk to you soon.